Welcome. In this video, I will quickly show how you can set up and use the newly introduced Now Bar feature on your Samsung Galaxy S25 lineup smartphone. So to start, you gotta keep in mind that this feature is enabled by default and to be perfectly honest with you, you won't need to do anything specific in order to switch it on. But you can launch your device's settings, enter the lock screen and AOD category and open the uh, now bar preferences to well configure it and personalize uh, what it has an access to, what information it provides you with and so on. So for example, you can switch on the now brief feature for the now bar which will put your briefings or summaries throughout the day morning afternoon or evening summaries into this now bar widget so you will be access you will be able to access the now brief summary from the now bar widget now you can also set up what things it will be displaying so uh, live notifications from which app and status changes from which apps it will show so you can switch those apps on or off as you please. You can also enable or disable for it to show the media player. So if you're listening to music, it will have the media controls on it or the current phone mode. So now let me quickly show you how this now bar feature works. So for example, let's launch the clock app and start a timer. Now the timer is started, which you can access from your notification panel as you would normally. But should I lock the screen? As you can see, we'll have this now bar both on the always on display as well as on the lock screen which now you can dismiss or uh, interact with whatever um, action the now bar is currently displaying or well, refer um, providing you the controls to with the controls to uh, let's also what else can I show to you? For example, maps. Let's let's try to use maps and show how maps work with the now bar widget. So for example, I will uh, look for the directions from Warsaw Presidential Hotel all the way up to, or I mean to Presidential hot, Hotel, Hotel, whatever, I just forgot how this word is properly pronounced, to, uh, well, airport for example and we'll set the drive let's actually i mean the car as our transportation mean let's tap on the preview s close the google maps and see if now bar it does not actually display and we didn't get the live notifications oh this is because this is the root preview how do i start a route please <laughs> That's interesting. Why well, am not? Well, I can preview the route, but I cannot actually start it, or what? It certainly seems like so. Uh, that's actually interesting. Something I didn't didn't do right, or what? Or since it cannot, yeah, since it does not have the location access, probably it cannot provide me provide me with those with the routing but well should you have your location enabled you will get the well now bar widget with directions and other useful information uh, maybe let's try to use the voice recorder and see if it it will actually provide us with the now bar widget yeah, it did uh, well have, or I mean, it does have the live notification, so that's already a good sign. And yep, indeed, the now bar shows the recording, which we can well, stop or pause from here and see the duration of also inside the now bar. If you have multiple things, actually, um, if you have multiple things working at the same time, you should also be able to switch between them. So if you have multiple live notification running simultaneously, I guess you should be able to switch between them and indeed you can. So tap over here. Let's see how, how, how we are supposed to switch between them. Like that, yeah, just um, shuffle them behind one another. Anyway, that's how you set up and use the now bar feature on your Galaxy S25 smartphone. So should you have any further questions, leave them in the comment section below. But just for now, thanks for watching and bye bye.